The stop and go can be used almost anywhere in the field. The basic idea of the stop and go is to trick the defender into a slow motion and then speeding up quickly after the defender almost fell asleep or took a nap. But the idea is to beat the defender with a change of rhythm. That's the basic idea, a change of rhythm to slow down and then accelerate after the defender gets teased into maybe moving closer or making the first step. But as soon as you slow down, you get ready to accelerate with your opposite foot. So you dribble at the defender or slightly to the side, you stop it with the leading leg, with the front leg, the, the dribbling leg, step on it with the tip of the toe, with the, with the bottom of the foot. And the opposite foot is coming in to kick it in the same direction you were supposed to be running anyway. So it's, there's not a change of direction, it's just a change of speed, it's a change of rhythm, it's a light touch on top of the ball to stop it, to slow your motion down, and then kick it with your opposite foot to gain, regain the speed again and beat the defender through a quick stop and go move, as the move is called. This is the basic idea of the stop and go.